like grass unleashed. <laughs> Uh, let's switch over to before we switch over to other stuff. Let's switch over to NXT that that we just watched like two hours ago. Did you did you keep it this week or did you not keep? It I did. No, I, I watched it. I watched. Okay. It. Yeah. Okay. Okay. I want to say. I want to say. Uh, so we kicked <laughs> off with uh, Carmelo Hayes mm-hmm. the fallout from Vengeance Day. What? <laughs> <laughs> shout out to a graphic I saw where they had literally the the Grand Theft Auto like font. Of that one, that was movie. that was Carmelo Hayes. He made that shit. He made that joint. Hey, yeah. shout out to Carmelo. Then that was uh that was nice. I gotta give him that. That was, you know, like I said, I love Hill Carmelo, man. I forgot how much I miss Hill Carmelo, and I'm like, oh, yeah. Now I remember. That's the Melo I miss. Much like we said with Drew, babyface Melo. Eh, he yeah, I right. he don't do it for me though. The swag comes from dark Melo. You know what I mean? He is him when he's cocky, and he's dark mellow. It makes sense. <laughs> Speaking of dark mellow, this man was standing out here, sitting, sitting in the ring in the spotlight like he was about to <laughs> drop the best freestyle of his life for Tubi. That Boy, man come was on. about to go full throttle once upon a time. Come on now. In a long, long time away. Uh, drop the beat. You know what I'm saying? Heck yeah. Wow, stop. <laughs> <laughs> boy, that boy, Melo, hey. You know what I'm saying? I was like, okay. But nah, man, mm-hmm. that, was, that, that was like my favorite part of the name. You know what I'm saying? Bow Marion. <laughs> Bow Marion, bro, hey. Bro, thank you. Because <laughs> I've been saying this man look like Bow Wow Slick for the longest now. And I'm like, bro, what the freak? I swear on everything, bro. He channeled that inner bow wow for real right there, boy. I said, you better go. <laughs> oh, man. Yo, that is wild, bro. You said mellow look ice cold in that, st- in that spotlight, man. Bro. Mm-hmm. Props to production. Props to him for selling us on it. Heck, even props to this crowd trying to hijack it. Sometimes I was just like, shut up. I, I didn't know pop. what they were saying the entire show. Until like uh, the ending shot, where it was like mellow trips coming for you. So they was like mellow trips coming for you, and I'm like, they're tr- I I I you, C for effort, F for annoying me. Yeah, yeah, because they were definitely doing that with some of those chants. Like it was just kind of like, bro, shut up, let the man talk. That's what I'm saying. We can pray. Sometimes NXT crowds hit. Sometimes mm-hmm. they do not hit. Yeah. And this like, is one of them. It's just like stick in this case, just stick to you, suck. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You suck. Or fuck you mellow. Yeah. Like, stick to that. But the whole yeah. trying to get these other stuff, I'm like, it was and it was dragging. And I'm like, mm-hmm. all right. I know he had to be a little bit annoyed by that though. Just a little bit. Probably just to him though, because he 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 brushed it off. He did. Mm-hmm. He brushed it off looking as light skinned as light skinned ninjas, boy. I'm telling had the you, most light skin look on his face. Like they already got us on probation for being light skin. Now he just added to it out of that promo. Oh man, dang! Those like Bow Wow and Amari at the same time. That's why I call him Bow Mario. Yeah, for sure. Mm-hmm. <laughs> that's mm-hmm. what I'm saying. I'm like, man, this man in this promo. But yo, he basically said, "Trick, you were all, you were never, you was always beneath me. You was my hype man. You didn't know your place." And I like that promo because it's oh, like yeah. they and he basically owned the fact that he attacked Trick. He said, "Yeah, I did it because you." Bro-, he said, "But you betrayed me first because we had an agreement. You go after the North American title, I go after the NXT title. You let these people get in your head, and you believed your own hype." And I like the fact that he was cocky. Mm-hmm. He was not. He didn't show no remorse, mm-hmm. and he embraced the delusion. Mm-hmm. Because the reason why I say he embraced that delusion after that match on Sunday, mm-hmm. Trick is worth every hype. That brother's oh. good. Oh yeah, yeah. He has oh, improved yeah. immensely. Immensely, bro. Like he's more than just a mouthpiece this time. Now he's the whole package at this point. <laughs> so it's just like the look, the swag. 
all that, you name it. But I also like him mentioning the fact that it's like, you know, you wearing your glasses like me. You out here uh, mimicking my walk like me. You over here doing this like me. Like, Melo over here trying to remind folks, like, hey, y'all was on me first. You know what I'm saying? Now y'all want to get on this guy. You know, so I'm like, all right, all right, let's see what you're doing, Melo. You, you, you remind the folks, like, you and your Roy Jones Jr., like, y'all must have forgot. You know what I'm saying? And, and again, that stupid crowd. Now, that one chat I did like that crowd doing when they was trying to say, you're not him. I did like them trying to say that because that almost yeah, I, like that one. I did like that one. I was like, okay, I get y'all that crowd when y'all say y'all not him, you're not him because it was almost like it was fueling him to just go even harder with his promo. So I, I'll take that. But aside from that, yeah, I could have relaxed on that. Luckily, he didn't lose his composure. Mm-hmm. He he stayed the course. He even trolled them with with tricks music, bro. My favorite part of that entire segment, bro. I don't know if she's still in the chat, but but she, she said I got up and start twerking out my bed and shit. And she's like, "Fuck you, <laughs> <laughs> bro." And I just love the way like he 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 did like that's how you know this man has been studying. He's been literally learning from the right. He Shawn Michaels, all of them have been teaching him because Shawn Michaels is the king of doing this. That time he. Had Bret Hart's music hit and was like, and he faked out all of Canada. And like, he was like, oh God, oh God, right? Before then, just laughing at him. <laughs> like, you idiots. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, that was classic Shawn Michaels in that moment. Like, Shawn's like, watch this. This is how you're really going to get him. And, and I was almost nervous because I was almost like, it got me for a slight split second because I was like, dang, man. I was just telling Gresh the other day, like, please keep him off TV for about a good couple of weeks. And then he did that and pulled the troll. I was like, yes, Melo. Yes. Troll. They handled it right. They handled it right. So I already know that return pop going to be insane. For real. And I'm I'm ready, man. I am ready. Oh, (laughs) yeah, man. She said, said, I'm still pissed. I don't blame you, sis. I don't blame you. I'd be pissed too. <laughs> she was like, "Yeah," and then he did. He's like, "Man, like you a hole, god damn like, you, you son of a bitch." <laughs> Fuck you. Nah, Fuck you. Man. yeah, man. That that is the perfect definition of I am a heel. Screw it. Like, shout out to Melo. Look, hey, listen, let me tell you, bro. Shout out to Mello. Shout out to Drew. Shout out to Roman. <laughs> hey, even Rock, if he turn around and do go heel off of this stuff, I, I'm for it. Let's go. God day, I'm with it. You mentioned Roman. This is what Seth was like on with his response on Raw. Bro, he got his ass cooked. He got cooked. Adrian, you didn't go down like that, huh? He got cooked. (laughs) (laughs) Oh, yeah, bro. Straight up cooked, bro. Everybody was cooking. Everybody was cooking. (laughs) Oh, boy. That boy deep fried and ready to get eat. I'm telling you. Pause, but still. (laughs) (laughs) Hey. <laughs> oh man! <laughs> Damn, man! What did you say, nigga? <laughs> oh boy! Hey! Oh man! <laughs> Oh, my inside hurt. <laughs> oh, man. Bro. This is what you get with me at Grudge Late Night, boy. You just never know. It's Unleashed, baby. That's what we do. <laughs> Dragging off out here beefing on behalf of Trip. Yeah, man. Real interesting, ain't it? I was just like, huh, okay. Yeah. And then this guy. <laughs> die Jack. I got die Jack. I was just like, Bro, did you see that punch he gave him though? 
Yeah. That shit split see. him open. I was like, damn, bro, you stiffing, ain't it? My. No one no one dragging off, he was like, give it to me. Probably, yeah. Because he because he loves pain. Fair point. Also, he's like a modern day Mick Foley in a sense. Yeah. As far as the pain part, or would you say Cactus Jack more so? A, well, Russian, a, Russian, a Russian Cactus Jack. Maybe, but listen, mankind took his fair share of pain too now. He the one that fell through the cage and off the cage. Cactus yeah. Jack didn't even go through the cage. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, this is true. When you mention it, Cactus Jack never flew off a cage. <laughs> off of that was himself. So, you know, now do love. We just put him over there, you know. That's it. <laughs> from the, hey, shout out to the ladies in the chat, man. Y'all, y'all keep us live tonight, bro. Y'all <laughs> keeping us live with these comments. So y'all keep, hey, keep it up, bro. <laughs> filet mignon, Seth freaking Rollins, bro. Straight up. And Carmelo Hayes filet mignon the crowd because they thought Trick Williams was coming out. Mm-hmm. So everybody oh. was, everybody was being petty. Hello, petty boy. I, I love pettiness, man, because I'm a petty nigga. So I, I can take a sip of that drink. You know what I'm saying? I know the glass is still over there somewhere. I'm gonna take that sip. Pinky out and all. Oh. oh yeah, man. <laughs> oh, speaking of that guy, I was listening to his podcast the other day or earlier today. And boy, I imagine my surprise when I was hearing them touch on Wade Barrett. <laughs> and Book was like, Yeah, man, it just it just didn't have the same. It just didn't he didn't wasn't hitting it. It, it really wasn't. wasn't. Shimon? He said the rhythm was just not there. I wasn't. <laughs> Poor way. He tried his best. You should have just had Byron Saxton on there like you did tonight. You might have gotten just a little bit better. Might have been a Carlton type of feel, but you would have still at least got some kind of soul. <laughs> oh. We're not doing that. Simone. What? Wrong mm-hmm. black guy, man. Damn. Mm-hmm. GI Bro does not approve. <laughs> I know, man. I know. I know. There it is. She poured one out for Trick Melogain on the show. <laughs> he said, Shimon with his old chest. I about turned my TV off. Hey, <laughs> you and me both. I, 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 I'm so glad I missed that. Now I'm at, y'all gonna make me go back and watch that just to laugh. Now I'm gonna go watch that. Trick with that. Shimon. Nigga, shut the fuck up. Oh, no. He said that? Yes. Trick with that. Shimon. Like... You f- you missed the whole beat for that Shimon, my bro. Oh my God, wait! Shimon should know. <laughs> should hell no. Man, I'm t- wait till we go off there. I'm turning this on. This. <laughs> I gotta see that one part, bro. How y'all gonna be? Y'all gonna nigga? Like that's for me the entire time. Like mm-mm, mm-mm. that's. That's what we doing. That's what we doing, bro. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. <laughs> she said I was begging. I was begging Booker to sue him again. <laughs> 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 sue him. Not even for gimmick infringement. Sue him for being off beat. That's what you sue him for. Again, I don't know what it is, but I felt so offended. I feel like we got to jump away. <laughs> 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 or stew. <laughs> Like, it's oh, like, bro, man. we gotta we, we gotta jump your ass, like, bro, we got fight back, like, we, we gotta gang up on your ass because that, I feel disrespected. <laughs> Y'all don't do that guy like that. He he, nah, he couldn't we, help himself. I'm gonna need him to try harder to help himself. Like, <laughs> help yourself. Try, try to help yourself find the beat. Was he? Would you say he was like? Okay, okay, I got a scenario for you, brother. You can call this either or both of them since we skipped over it. 
Wade Barrett's off rhythmness and the Trick Mellow and, and Trick Williams' entrance on Sunday? Or them Kansas City Chiefs fans celebrating with that swag surf all off beat. <laughs> yeah. Which one? <laughs> yeah, you got it. <laughs> Come on, Chris. Come on. Come on, bro. You gotta you gotta do it. <laughs> <laughs> oh shoot. Oh man, you gonna make me breathe, bro. <laughs> mm-hmm. <laughs> oh, says he sure did. <laughs> Kansas City wins. <laughs> well, the people have spoken. I guess the Chiefs get more or less rhythm than Wade Barrett. Both of them. <laughs> Both them shits was ass, bruh. Capital B O L L. Surfing? Nigga. The beat already passed y'all twice before you hit the up. My God. What? Mm hmm. Mm hmm. And then we already said whoop that trick like three times before he said shum on like <sighs> yep. wow. mm -hmm. wow. mm -hmm. mm. terrible 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 what else happened on NXT? What happens on NXT? Oh JC Jane gonna have Thea Hill single by the end of the Valentine's Day. Oh yeah, she totally cop blocking. On the play hard. You got to play hard to get. No, you don't. It's 2024. Tell me how you feel. I don't play these games. <laughs> Fuck all that. Yeah. That's you that. Tell me how you feel. That's that. I ain't got no man talk trying to keep you from getting one, too. Mm -hmm. Basically. That's, that's we, it. We all went to school in 2008. We know exactly what that is. Like mm -hmm. that 2008 vibe. Mm -hmm. I ain't got a man. You ain't getting one either. <laughs> or she's setting her up to where she's going to swoop in and steal him. Ooh. Yeah, there's that too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But then where the heck does Lexus King fit in all this then? Is he just the pun to make that seem that way? Because <laughs> if that's the case, then why are two men fighting for her and not even looking at you? That's the That's the jealousy part. Mmm, okay, okay. And they're fighting right. over Thea, but they're not really fighting over JC. You just you just over there. Mm -hmm. you, just, you just over there selling calendars. All right, I see. <laughs> it's, funny how it's funny how people think on Twitter think I bought that shit. <laughs> I was trolling. I did not buy that shit. It'd be funny if you had a real WWE package like show up and, and made niggas think that was a calendar and it was something totally different. <laughs> Like, oh look, it arrived. Psych, you nigga stupid. I ain't, I ain't, I ain't horny. <laughs> not, not like that. No. Uh, Monique said, "JC, a, JC, a hater." Yeah, for so she is. He's definitely. She a I mean, yeah. come on, Gigi. Right. What she already show y'all with Gigi? So you already know she gonna hate on Thea. Come on now. Uh, what else? Oh, they did the Wolf Dogs. So go, did you peep that opening tag? That tag match was good. Yeah, man. But yet again, <laughs> Malik Blade and we Jesus lose. Adolfe, we lose on during Black History Month again. I'm gonna say this again. Can we stop losing in our month, please? Dynamite, you better get it right. I swear, if I see one black person on that show lose. We're gonna have a problem. That goes for you too, TNA. <laughs> God dang it. No black people losing it this month, bro. Stop. Stop it. WWE <laughs> didn't already lost my mm, man. 
What it was our overall record this year? This this month, like zero what? and two and two and and three thousand five hundred and fifty. And we only we already in February six. The only uh, one who won was Oba Femi. See, see, what I'm saying? Yeah, they basically after that tag match, they basically teasing Braun Breaker and uh Baron Corbin versus the Wolf Dogs versus uh Stax and the Angel. The oh, family. yeah, the family. The family. The family. Hmm. You think the Wolf Dogs get the titles? I wouldn't be surprised. They're kind of over. Hashtag, we want to win on Black History Month. Exactly. Thank you. Sis, yes, keep that trend alive. I want to see that. Yeah, let's 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 go ahead. Let's get that trending. Outside of, we want, outside of we want Cody mm-hmm. and we want, we want uh, Rocky. Let's get mm-hmm. that trending. Also, let's nice. get we want money. More important shit. Thank you. We in recession. We in an inflation right now. Hashtag fix this economy. Fix this economy. That's what we need to get trending. Like today. Shit. Thank shit, you. I'm tired of this. Tired of this, this. This shit ain't trending. <laughs> anyway, I ain't shy about loving the cheeks. That's why Gresh can't see my tweets because I can't stop liking. It. Nigga, what? Um. Okay. I am cool. not your diary, my my guy. <laughs> Oh, oh man, you said that like 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 you cheating on brush or something, like he was your man or something, dog. It's all love though, man. We just we just messing with you, bro. <laughs> it called me up, girl. I'm like, I said that shit in my Discord too. This dude, this dude be just venting in the Discord, and I'll be like, nigga, are we your diary right now? <laughs> Why are you telling me this? My boy, I just want to let you know and make it known to the world. That's all, I'm dog. Let you know, I'm, I'm, I'm liking these cheeks. Hey, bro, we, we men, we like cheeks too. But you ain't got to we'd, be, we'd actually be quite concerned if you didn't, my friend. That's yeah. all. Yeah, I'd be, I'd be, I'd be, I'd be questioning your, your man, <laughs> your manhood, or you're asexual, and that's cool too. But yeah, <laughs> no, we are not. He just caught us off guard. We are not talking about cheeks. We talking about cheeks? What cheeks? Who cheeks? Red cheeks? Blue cheeks? Please go to hell. <laughs> <laughs> what are we on tonight, boy? It is Gresh Unleashed for real. <laughs> Whole night, baby. What else happened on this show? Oh, uh, Josh Briggs snapped on Jensen. Yeah, I felt more like a tough love kind of thing to me, man. Just wake up. I mean, I don't, I don't, I felt like I would have said the same thing to homie. Snap out of it, bro. They moved on. Learn to find your place. That man just said, Stop being a bitch and come on. (laughs) 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 Yes. You know, that's so accurate. Oh, that's accurate as hell. Oh, bruh. Stop being a bitch and come on. Wake up. Oh, my goodness. You out here living in the past? Fallon's doing solid. I'm doing solid. And you just out here moping around. He's he like, it's a performance center full of people who want to take your spot. What you mm-hmm. bitching for? Mm-hmm. Wake up. Wake up, bro. And some people, honestly, that's some real nigga shit. You need that. You need that tough love. Mm-hmm. You need that tough love. So wow. I appreciate that segment. I'm like, yeah, hey, keep it real. Mm-hmm. Keep it a hundred. And the show closed out basically with uh, Carmelo Hayes targeting. Uh, well, after this, cr- what you think about this match? This match was crazy. Yeah, you know they got they got chemistry, man. I mean, Dijak slick in an underrated kind of way. He doesn't know how to put on many bad matches with people. I mean, he pretty much is like as they call him the workhorse of NXT at this point, in a sense. He obviously got screwed by Joe Gacy. <laughs> And they're, some they're cartoon good. Tasmanian devil Bugs Bunny like way, the old <laughs> classic, the whole classic punching club. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody please clip that and just put like straight up cartoon noises around it. Trust me. Oh, hang him high when he, when he get off the you tour the suspension. He probably do some some stupid shit like that. Mm-hmm. <laughs> the, uh, and then Carmelo obviously closed the show standing tall because he attacked Trick. I mean, not Trick. Uh, Dragon off. To let him know that he's coming for for that title. Oh, and they cheer for Ava because you know. So shout out to NXT crowd. They know 
Uh, he practically called him pussy. <laughs> <laughs> Basically, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and how can I? My apologies, ladies. We saw uh, metaphors. Jakar Jackson and Last Legend beat Fallon Henley. Good. And uh, what's that old girl name? Ren Sinclair. No, what the fuck was she? What the fuck does she have on, bro? Like, what is happening here? Typical rookie. Like, like what is this? What is? I'm like, I'm too high for this shit. <laughs> It just sounds like what Fallon Henley said. You see this facial expression? Like, I can't believe I tagged with you. Damn, I should have followed Tiffany to the main roster. <laughs> it's, just, it's, just, it's the last time I tagged with some rookie ass. <laughs> like, that's why you need to stop being Captain Saber Ho and focus on your own career. No, nah, facts. Go do you, sis. Stop tagging with rookies. Anyways, speaking of rookies, that's another thing. Can't forget about my girl, Kiana James, over here bullying nobodies in the locker room. We doing that again? That's what we doing. We bullying the youngins. We doing Kiana. that again? Kiana. We doing that again? We doing that gimmick again? Do they not know any other form of mean girls? They just got to be bullies? That's what we doing? That's all y'all know how to write. That's all y'all know how to write for these women. <laughs> yeah. Crazy, ain't yeah. it? There's no other, other crazy. I'm gonna need y'all to get some new materials. We've been doing this since the 90s. Mm -hmm. And the wild part is literally, you just did a vignette with her on Sunday saying that she was coming after you know what I'm saying? Like, how, how do you how did you go from that to this? I was like, what? Right. Oh, yeah, Roxanne beat Lola Vice. So I like that match up. actually. That was very, very physically stiff between those ladies, man. They Crazy were... Rock is still is, is becoming a thing. I'm cool with that. Yeah, I'm I'm kind of getting cool with it too. Especially if she hard hitting people like that. I'm like, good lord, girl, you showing aggression. You channeling <laughs> that Daniel Bryan in you, ain't you? I ain't bet. Right. You know what I, mean? I said, okay. And, and Lola Vice, like I said, she, she is still just, you know. Still looking kind of dumb, you know, because you fell for the it's, it's like baby face syndrome in a sense. You fell for it. Tatum Paxley trying to channel her in the R Truth. You trying to cash in a contract that's already cashed in. What the frick? I said, I said what was know, that? I'm like, she's been taking notes from R Truth, I guess. She out there, oh, oh, my bad. You, you mean I'm not my, my bad, my bad. Like, okay, cool. I guess. I guess. <laughs> what even That's... a title match? <laughs> like, what are you cashing in on, ma'am? What the freak, bro? I'm done. She like, must have got the... kicked in the head too hard on Sunday. That's what it was. Had to. <laughs> oh, boy. Oh, boy. Mm -hmm. the club go around here, I'm a cat. This bang bang gang, got a whole bang, huge bang. Jack. When I'm in the ring, it's just me and my best friends. OC cutting no slack. Hollywood right. Miz, you can put me on the A-list. Crush unleash, better put it on your playlist. Me and my fam be ballin' like the Bruce. Fight night, baby, hard hitting like Shane. Family first, yes, bloodline business. Winning all the gold. Look at how they witness. I 